Hey guys, Matt Starr, mattstarcoaching.com. I want to give you three things that you can do right now and anytime if you notice that you are feeling stressed, feeling tense. So there's a lot of stuff going on, a lot of people talking, a lot of people worrying, a lot of people tense, and that is contagious. And so whether or not you're surrounded by people who are really immersed in that or you're surrounded by people who are pretty laid back, it's just in the air. And I even noticed in the last couple of days that I got this like tension going through this, my neck in here. Now I've been at my computer a lot, so that's part of it. But also it's my body telling me to just take a break. So three things that you can do. First thing you can do is breathe. So just stop whatever you're doing. Close your eyes if you can. You breathe in through your nose for three seconds. Hold it for three seconds and then exhale through your mouth for three seconds. So it's literally inhale, one, two, three, hold it, one, two, three, exhale, one, two, three, and then hold that, one, two, three, inhale. Right, so this is an exercise that I learned as a singer. And a lot of times for meditation, they'll tell you to breathe in and breathe out and do it slow. But you can actually increase it from three to four to five to six. You can go a really long time breathing in and you'll feel your lungs open up. And it, and it, gives, your, it gives your brain something to do as well. So you're not focused on whatever you're thinking or feeling right at the moment. Okay, so that's the first thing you can do. The second thing you can do is an affirmation. So you may already have one. If you don't have one, a really easy way to do that is think about what your worst fear is. So I'm going to be broke. I'm going to get sick. I'm going to lose my house. I'm going to not find work, you know, whatever it is. And, and, you know, you don't have to tell anybody about it. So be real. What is your deepest, darkest fear about you? Make up the opposite, right? So if your fear is I'm going to lose my job, you say something to the effect of I am, so it's an affirmative statement, I am living my dreams, doing work that is fulfilling and provides me lots of income and I help and change people's lives. Something like that. So it's just the complete opposite of what your fear is. Another one that's just a classic, this one's been around for a long time, and it's every day in every way I am getting better, right? And so you can apply that. That can mean whatever that means to you, right? So that can be health. That can be if there's a character uh, trait that you're working on, you know, if you are a musician, then yeah, you're getting better at that, but you're just getting better. You're getting better at life. You're getting better at being the best that you can be. Okay. And then the third thing you can do is to just pause and think about something that you're grateful for. For something, someone, and it just needs to be genuine. So, you know, you could think my, I'm grateful that I have two working eyes. Now that at some time I think, well, that's kind of stupid. Two eyes. Well, yeah, because there's people that don't have eyes and there's people that can't see or there's people that can see out of one eye or have a patch or have an eye that's, you know, doesn't work properly. Right. So if you've got two working eyes, that's good. Imagine if you didn't. So it's very simple. Or you can think of something, you know, I'm so grateful for my family or I'm grateful for my friends or my my career or my home or whatever it is. So I hope those are helpful. They've worked for me for years and years and years. And it's just the main thing is that you're willing to stop, stop whatever you're doing and take the time to do something that is in the interest of improving the quality of your life. And that in itself has a huge benefit. So don't worry about how well you do the breathing exercise or how you know, well, you come up with something to be grateful for. Just do it and know that you did something that was towards your highest, best quality of life. All right. Be safe. Be smart. Be chill. Be grateful. See you.